Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Before we start, let me check my teeth to make sure I don't have any food in it because I seem to be doing that a lot lately. But anyways, as you see, I'm super excited to show you guys what I've been doing to keep my makeup on all day. <laughs> as you can see here, we gotta keep that makeup on lock. I don't know why I did that so many times, but we're just going to keep moving right in with letting you guys know that today's video is sponsored by Patchology and their Breakout 3-in-1 Acne Treatment Kit. Thank you, Patchology, for keeping me off the streets. Honestly, thank you so much. We'll be talking about that later in the video. Starting off, we're going to be using our Tatcha Silk Canvas Primer. I love this primer, you guys. It is so good for filling in the pores, and it's also like a protectant against your makeup. Like It keeps the makeup out of your pores and keeps your skin snatched all day. As you can see, I look sickening. And then going on with the Fenty Booty Foundation. I love this foundation because it's a medium coverage, but it lasts all day through humidity, through anything, girl, even sex, you need to get this foundation. It is sickening boots. I'm not even kidding. But sometimes it's not as full coverage as I like. So I'm going to add one more pump. As you can see there, I don't know why I monologued this. I don't even know if this is monologuing, whatever that it is, where I just like am telling myself what to say in this voiceover. <laughs> but then we're going with the tried and true tart shape tape. I love this. You love this. The whole country loves this damn concealer. It is so good at just staying out all day. It doesn't really cake up. It doesn't really crease that much. If you set it, you really need to set this um, concealer. I know it is a matte concealer, but I really do recommend setting it because you'll keep it on all day. And as I said earlier, it's just going to snatch your under eyes. We love a good snatch sisters on this channel. And then I'm going to take my Born This Way powder underneath my eyes. I love this powder because there's no flashback. And then, to surprise y'all, I'm going in with a little bit more. <laughs> just kidding. Not su not surprising at all. <laughs> I'm just setting um, where I probably would crease or maybe get oily throughout um, the night. And then I'm going in with the Huda Beauty Powder, which you guys know I didn't like at first, but I do like it after my face is already set. And then you guys know I am the bronze goddess of the beauty industry. I may have been fired from the beauty industry a few years ago, but girl, I'm still back at it again with some butter bronzer. I literally... Okay, I literally love this bronzer. It is so good. It's so, it's not really matte. I would say it's kind of luminous, but not like shimmery, if that makes sense. It's just very natural. And I go very ham on it because I know I'm just going to bake it later. And then I'm going to go in with some more powder. This is what um I learned. This is a trick that I learned from Jeffree Star in Lipstick Nick called Veiling. It makes it a little bit more smoother. And I'm able to do this because I didn't really set my face. And then I'm going to bake my face with the Huda Beauty Powder. And then for some reason, I don't know why, I haven't been really liking powder br blushes. I've been really liking eyeshadow, so I'm going in with the shade from the new Sultry Palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. i just seen that, like, and kind of noticed that just eyeshadows just last way longer, if you know what I mean. Like, blushes always disappear so quick, so using eyeshadow really just stays locked in all day. And then I'm saying that with more powder. Keep in mind that I'm using very minimal powder every single time I say I put more powder on. And then get rid of that powder look. We are going with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. You guys all know that this is sickening. So I'm just going to put a lot on, as you can see. And then I'm going with a discontinued product. As you see here, very sad about that. But the Anastasia X Nicole Guerrero. I love this palette, you guys. You guys are about to see that this palette is the most sickening highlighter that you will ever put on in your entire life. If you have it, you already know. Bam. Oh, my God. All the cowboys' boots just flew off. Oh, my God. Yes, God. Yes, God. As I said there. Just yes, God. We are turning religious today, girl. Yes, God. Gotta highlight that little button nose that I did not get plastic surgery on. Everyone thinks I got plastic surgery on when I was like four, but I really didn't. I'm just sickening. And then this was a mistake though. I'm using the Claire Bronze from the Anastasia Glow Kick. So I usually use Hourglass, the darker shade there. But as you can see, it kind of made it a little bit muddy just because obviously that's not the correct highlighter for my skin. But we're just going to roll with the punches in this video today. And then going with my KKW Brightening Powder in the shade 1. I love this powder, you guys. This is a must-have. You don't even have a choice. I'm not even giving you a choice. You guys are going to get it. And you can use my, the code EATMYASS at checkout. And then because I'm just a natural beauty, I'm going with the bronze, the bronzer that I used earlier, the butter bronzer, and just running this through my crease and underneath my eye just to give a little bit of definition because this is a very simple look. This is just a very, like, go out of tone, you know, Meet up with your trade, girl, your grinder hookup. You know what I mean? Like, just very that. We're just serving that. And 
we have the highlighter in a corner to so be able to do that to catch the boys' eyes. And then going with my favorite brand new bottle, some Bellas. I love the style Bella, so good. And that is also the best duo eye glue. Um, you're about to see the transformation of me going from a man to an actual woman. I will leave um the link to new bounce and bella lashes down in the description. I love these lashes, like I said, and you guys can use code Coesworld to save some coin. And I like just meshing everything together with some mascara. This is Benefit Roller Lash. And then I made the mistake of obviously hitting my nose with it, because what would it, what would, what would my life be without getting mascara on my nose? Like, if you could describe me in one sentence, it would be mascara on the nose. That's literally just me. And then for the lip product, I'm going with the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. I love this for, just for a glossy look, but it is a skincare um, product as well. And then set everything all in place with your messed up lashes, because you can't put on lashes for your life. And then we're going to start posing for the gods. Yes! Now moving on to the sponsored portion of this video, we're going to be using the Patchology Breakout Box. This is a three-step kit that includes a nose strip, salicylic acid dots, and also hydrochloride dots. First step is we're going to be wetting our nose to be applying the nose strip. This nose strip was made with volcanic ash to really help get deep in those pores and pull out any blackheads. It was made specifically so that doesn't hurt also when you guys are pulling it off. And then we're going to be moving on with the salicylic acid dots. This is a great ingredient for any acne that could be, like, coming in. It, it really helps bring acne to the surface, especially pimples. If you guys know, stubborn acne is so annoying because it, it's there for a while. So these really help bring it to the surface so that you guys can go on to the next step, which is the hydroclide dots. These are for the pimples that are already at the surface, and it's really going to help heal the skin underneath the patch. Thank you so much for Patchology for sponsoring this video. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. I'm so glad to be back on YouTube. Don't forget to subscribe down below, like this video, and also don't forget to comment. I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.